Can you discuss the threat from Chinese hacking into our electrical grid? Ah, that's an interesting question. Chinese threat. This was discussed at a conference that was in the open, and it was pointed out that the Chinese, up until about 05, their military journals, just like the ones our military puts out, like Proceedings, uh, there were articles about EMP issues, and suddenly it just dried up completely. There's not a word coming out of China about any kind of research, and some people refer to it as the Chinese enhanced bomb. Are the Chinese looking at how to enhance a gamma ray burst coming off of the bomb, which then means a higher EMP output? In other words, a weapon specifically designed for a maximum EMP. That's the declassified open air stuff. I don't know what's going on behind the curtain. But, you know, the Chinese, this is going to sound crazy, the Chinese don't scare me too much. Because their infrastructure is as delicate as ours. And there's really three worlds in China. There's the world that we see, which is about the four to five hundred million Chinese who are essentially living in a first world environment. But if you get about 50 miles outside of Beijing, you start entering into the second world. Have any of you ever been, how many have been to China? Okay. You know what I mean? Every square inch of any ground where you can grow anything is planted in something you can grow to eat. There's a third world, which I'm told has a very Maoist lean to it still. You got something like an estimated 50 million people in China are still living in caves. So they're as afraid of a major meltdown of their system as we should be concerned. And by the way, the Chinese tend to go more for economic hegemony than direct military attack. That's been their tradition for a couple thousand years. Uh, try and look through history as to the Chinese actually doing aggressive war of a great advancement to snatch up territories the way Western Europeans and even we have done. So the Chinese have as much to lose as we do. Now, if a rogue state right next door to them does something that messes us up, they'll you know, just shrug and say, gee, that's too bad. But remember, they lose a major market as well.